Hey guys, um, the air freshener thing is making really loud noises right now. It should turn off in a moment. Hopefully you guys can hear me. There we go. Um, I wanted to make a kind of short video, um, just another shout out for Shani and let her know that she's not alone and that, um, you know, take all the time that you need until you feel that you're ready to come back and make videos. Um, about eight or so years ago, I had a YouTube channel that did pretty decent for itself. Um, at one point I made one video that got a lot of views and YouTube had come to me and asked for a partnership. And I turned it down uh, because I'm not on YouTube to make money. Um, I'm just here to make videos for fun. And so, I'm sorry, my son is thinking it's okay to go up and down off at the table. Um, so this one video was titled, How I Used to Do My Hair and Makeup. And I pretty much just kind of did what everybody else did on YouTube at the time. Um, lip syncing videos and speeding them up. Um, and then I did this one video because everybody started doing hair and makeup tutorials and everything like that. And I thought, you know, hey, why not show everybody how I used to do my hair and makeup? And that one video, that one video, I felt ruined my life. <laughs> like, um, I got so many mean and nasty comments that really did not help my mental situation and I quit YouTube. Um, I just gave up on all three of my accounts and I gave it up. Um, two years ago I opened another YouTube account and I dedicated it just to my hamster that I had at the time. I didn't want to show my face. I didn't want people to know who I was. And I felt like I needed to hide myself from YouTube and from all the people who gave me nasty comments because I just didn't want to see and I didn't want to hear it anymore. It, it was becoming no longer fun and I wanted it so bad to be a fun and enjoyable experience for me. And to hear how emotional you are getting because of all those stupid haters, and I don't even want to call them haters, they're just nasty people who want to feel better about themselves and their situations, who are deciding to leave bad comments because they have nothing else better to do. And yesterday it was so nice to see Danny stick up for you because I never really had anybody to stand up for me like on YouTube and I didn't have like supporters or people that were really standing up for me like so I was kind of on my own but you know I do understand when you need a break and it's perfectly fine it's your life it's your decision and anybody who's like oh she's just running away is selfish um, and they truly don't understand. Um, your, I was reading through your comments on the, this last video that you made, and there's so many loving Shanny Fanny responses on there, and it makes me so happy to see them. You guys are so wonderful, and she needs all the support that we can give her right now. Um, because the more support somebody has, the, the more confidence and 
just I wish that I had more support when I was making videos before um, it because it really hurts I don't care what anybody says about n ignoring the mean comments you don't ignore them if you read them you don't ignore them and you can't really know if they're mean comments or not unless you read them and you may think and say that it doesn't bug you but deep down inside it's all going to build up and eventually you'll know how it feels and to those people who just like to start drama and like to see that they're breaking somebody down I don't know what happened to you in life I don't know what's going on t with you in life but if you have nothing else better to do than to break somebody down when they're already going through a rough time then maybe you should find something better to do with your life I cannot imagine there must be something mentally wrong with you if you're leaving comments like that seriously nobody in their right mind would tell another person to kill themselves nobody in their right mind would sit there and watch a video that they didn't want to watch did you ever maybe think about that that maybe there's something mentally not right with you because you're wasting your time watching videos and and posting comments that are absolutely rude and pointless to anybody who does that maybe you should take a real hard look at your life before you go and judge other people and that's all I have to say Shani you're wonderful you're beautiful you're worth it and I really really hope that you get better and we are we are Shani fans are all here and we love you and we want you to get better and you know we want you to know that it's okay we we really do we want you to take this time take as long as you need to get yourself back to where where you want to be and we are all going to be here loving and waiting for you we'll watch your old videos and we'll we'll make it we'll make it through and if ever you need to talk to anybody who loves and supports you we are all here you know who we are and yeah <laughs> so you are beautiful you are worth it and we are all too love you shani Mwah.